Welcome back, playboys. Welcome back, my friends, to conversational topics. Today, I want to talk about smoothness, being smooth in transitioning from topic to topic. Because I noticed sometimes when I put a microphone on my student and send him there to talk with a girl, he opens the topic and he's talking about I don't know, music, blah, blah, blah. He talks about music and then he wants to talk about traveling. And then he goes like, you know, yeah, I know I love to, I love to listen to music. But by the way, I like New York. Have you been in New York? She's like, what the fuck? How did the guy jump from a music to the New York? And then he's like talking about it and she's like, okay, whatever. There's like a little, like, you know, what the fuck? But then, okay, New York. She's talking about it in New York. And then he's like, movies. You like movies? She's like, from New York to the movies. It's too rough. These are very rough transitions. Okay? So, um, and that's okay. Sometimes girls will notice and they will comment like, what the fuck, you know? Sometimes they'll just swallow and go. But she doesn't feel good. She's not feeling good. It's not smooth. Okay? And it looks like, okay, you have fucking check mark. Okay, we talk about this, then we talk about this, bam, bam, bam. So it looks, it feels wrong. And I want you to be a smooth. Conversation has to be like a milk. Like it just, it just like oil. It just smooth and it just flows. And she's not even she's not even triggering her. Okay, what's happening? What, why is he doing this? What's doing wrong? It's just it's just smooth and easy, smooth conversation that's leading towards seduction. Okay, so to create that, you need to have this smooth transitioning between topic to topic. So, for example, let's talk. Let's music and travel. Let's connect these two things in a smooth way. So you can say, you know what? I love music. Music is an important part of my life. Like, you know, I have like a playlist for my car when I'm pumping, driving good, something smooth. I have like a kind of music for home, kind of chill out, some lounge music. When I'm, when I'm, before I'm going out, you know, when I wake up in the morning, I love to listen like some like an you know, African drums, like something to wake me up, something hardcore. Music is an important part of my life. Even when I travel, I take music with me. Because I, like, you know, I like to kind of, you know, kind of be in an airplane, kind of listen to good music, you know, chill out, you know, kind of. And I don't know, so whenever I go, I take music with me because music is part of my life. Speaking of which of traveling, you know, you love to travel? See how smooth was it? Then let's say, okay, from, from traveling to movies, okay, you can say, you know what? I love to travel. And... But one thing I'm disappointed about when I travel is like, you know, kind of sometimes I end up like, like let's say New York. New York on the movies is totally different than a New York in real life or any city. Like, you know, because they're only showing the best parts, the best streets, the best restaurants. So you get totally wrong image, like, you know, obviously. So basically, sometimes I, you have these kind of dreams or this image about the, the city and then you go there and then it, it's nothing like that in the movies. Actually, one of my favorite movies actually that kind of showed me the real way was like you know, when I was in Africa. And now you go like, a, let's say like in a bloody diamond. Where basically, I was, I was having a coffee with a friend of mine. And basically, we, were, we jumped somehow on this set. They were recording like, you know, the bloody diamond movie with uh, Leonardo DiCaprio. And that's how I met like a Leo. Actually, a really interesting guy, blah, blah, blah. And then you move on topic like, you know, you're not bragging, but you're smoothly connecting. Speaking of the movies. What's your favorite movie? What kind of movies do you like? So, have a smooth way to talk. Don't never jump from one topic to another topic in a rough, crazy way. Smoothen out. Make a story that's transitioning from topic to topic. It's kind of having a bridge between things. And this is the wisdom of this week. If you liked, this video, make sure you subscribe to my YouTube channel here to get more videos like this. As well, check out my other stuff here and make sure you visit badboylifestyle.com for other dating and seduction articles. Bye.